I want to teach you how to use the sequence function in Excel to create a dynamic calendar. Now the sequence function is rather a new function in Office 365 and now this is how it works. So it's equal to sequence. The sequence, when you select the sequence function, it tells you returns a sequence of numbers. For example, if I want a sequence of 10 numbers, I'll type like that so it will give me a sequence in rows of 1 to 10. If I want a sequence of columns and rows, I'll type is equal to sequence. I want uh, four rows and seven columns. Then I enter. So it will give me a dynamic array of one to seven all the way to 28. Now, if I want to get a calendar, for example, the first day of September, I'm recording this video in September, so I want a sequence of a calendar that has four rows and seven columns to the calendar the, the days of the week then i'm going to start on the first day so i'll type date then pick the year which is 2022 the month is nine and the day is one then i close the brackets then i press enter so this will give me a date uh, numbers which i can format these to days by right clicking then format cells once i format i can go to custom and pick this instead so i can pick the date any date column here then change this to dd to give me the days of the week and i click okay so this way this will give me the first day of september all the way to 28th if i want a proper calendar then we must make sure that the first day of the week is uh, or the first day of the calendar is on a Sunday. 